Athera is a free lossy video compression format. It is developed by the XIPH, Org Foundation and distributed without licensing fees alongside their other free and open media projects, including the Vorbis audio format and the OG container. The LibTheora Video Codec is the reference implementation of the Thera video compression format being developed by the XIPH, Org Foundation. Thera is derived from the formerly proprietary VP3 codec, released into the public domain by On2 Technologies. It is broadly comparable in design and bitrate efficiency to MPEG-4 Part 2, early versions of Windows Media Video, and Real Video while lacking some of the features present in some of these other codecs. It is comparable in open standards philosophy to the BBC's Dirac codec. Thera is named after Thera Jones, Edison Carter's controller on the Max Headroom television program. In 2014, a bug requesting Thera support on Android was closed. Won't fix obsolete. Wikipedia stopped preferring OG Thera and now prefers WebM. Topic: <laughs> Technical details. Thera is a variable bitrate, DCT-based video compression scheme. Like most common video codecs, Thera also uses chroma subsampling, block-based motion compensation and an 8x8 DCT block. Pixels are grouped into various structures, namely blocks, superblocks, and macroblocks. Thera supports intracoded frames and forward predictive frames, but not by predictive frames which are found in H.264 and VC1. Thera also does not support interlacing, or bit depths larger than 8 bits per component. Thera video streams can be stored in any suitable container format, but they are most commonly found in the OG container with Vorbis or FLAC audio streams. This combination provides a completely open, royalty free multimedia format. It can also be used with the Matroska container. The Thera video compression format is essentially compatible with the VP3 video compression format, consisting of a backward compatible superset. Thera is a superset of VP3 and VP3 streams with some minor syntactic modifications can be converted into Thera streams without recompression but not vice versa. VP3 video compression can be decoded using Thera implementations but Thera video compression usually cannot be decoded using old VP3 implementations. Topic: History Thera's predecessor on 2 TrueMotion VP3 was originally a proprietary and patent encumbered video codec developed by On2 Technologies. VP3.1 was introduced in May 2000 and followed three months later by the VP3.2 release, which is the basis for Thera. <laughs> Move to free software In August 2001, On2 on Technologies announced that they would be releasing an open source version of their VP3.2 video compression algorithm. In September 2001, On2 on Technologies published the source code of the VP3.2 codec under the VP3.2 public license 0.1, a custom open source license. The license only granted the right to modify the source code if the resulting larger work continued to support playback of VP3.2 data. In March 2002, ON2 responded to the public's reception by relicensing the VP3 codec under the new Lesser General Public License. In June 2002, ON2 donated VP3 to the XIPH, Org Foundation and offered it under the OG Vorbis BSD style license. ON2 also made an irrevocable, royalty-free license grant for any patent claims it might have over the software and any derivatives, allowing anyone to use any VP3-derived codec for any purpose. In August 2002, ON2 entered into an agreement with the XIPH, Org Foundation to make VP3 the basis of a new, free video codec, called Thera. ON2 declared Thera to be VP3's successor. On 3 October 2002, ON2 2 and XIPH announced the completion and availability of the initial alpha code release of LibTheora, Thera's reference implementation. There is no formal specification for VP3's bitstream format beyond the VP3 source code published by ON2 2 Technologies. In 2003, Mike Melanson created an incomplete description of the VP3 bitstream format and decoding process at a higher level than source code, with some help from ON2 2 and XIPH, Org Foundation. The Thera specification adopted some portions of this VP3 description. Project Dala is working on the successor to Thera. Topic: 
Topic: Thera I specification. The Thera I bitstream format was frozen in June 2004 after the Libthiora 1.0 Alpha 3 release. Videos encoded with any version of the Libthiora since the Alpha 3 will be compatible with any future player. This is also true for videos encoded with any implementation of the Thera I specification since the format freeze. The Thera I specification was completely published in 2004. Any later changes in the specification are minor updates. The Thera reference implementation Libthiora spent several years in alpha and beta status. The first alpha version was released on the 25th of September 2002 and the first beta version was released on the 22nd of September 2007. The first stable release of Libthiora was made in November 2008. Work then focused on improving the codex performance in the Thusnelda branch, which was released as version 1.1 in September 2009 as the second stable Libthiora release. This release brought some technical improvements and new features, such as the new rate control module and the two-pass rate control. The codename for the next version of Libthiora is Talibvorm. Thera is well established as a video format in open source applications, and is the format used for Wikipedia's video content. However, the proposed adoption of Thera as part of the baseline video support in HTML5 resulted in controversy. Topic: Performance. Topic: Encoding performance. Evaluations of the VP3 and early Thera encoders found that their subjective visual quality was inferior to that of contemporary video codecs. More recently however, XIPH developers have compared the 1.1 Thera encoder to YouTube's H.264 and H.263 Plus encoders, in response to concerns raised in 2009 about Thera's inferior performance by Chris Dibona, a Google employee. They found the results from Thera to be nearly the same as YouTube's H.264 output, and much better than the H.263 Plus output. The performance characteristics of the Thera 1.0 reference implementation are dominated mostly by implementation problems inherited from the original VP3 code base. Work leading up to the 1.1 stable release was focused on improving on or eliminating these. A May 2009 review of this work shows a considerable improvement in quality, both subjectively and as measured by PSNR, just by improving the forward DCT and quantization matrices. A flaw in the version of FFmpeg used in the test initially led to incorrect reports of Thera PSNR surpassing that of H.264. Although not achieving this goal, the improvement in the measured PSNR and the perceived quality is considerable. In any case, the differences in quality, bitrate and file size between a YouTube H.264 video and a transcoded OGG video file are negligible. Further work on adaptive quantization, as well as overall detailed subjective tuning of the codec, is still to come. <laughs> <laughs> Playback performance There is an open source VHDL code base for a hardware Thera decoder in development. It began as a 2006 Google Summer of Code project, and it has been developed on both the NIOS 2 and Leon processors. However, there are currently no Thera decoder chips in production, and portable media players, smartphones, and similar devices with limited computing power rely on such chips to provide efficient playback. But since decoding Thera is less CPU intensive than decoding H.264, the need for hardware accelerated Thera decoding may be somewhat less. Topic: Playback. Topic: Native browser playback. As originally recommended by HTML5, these browsers support Thera when embedded by the video element. Mozilla Firefox 3.5 and later versions including Firefox for mobile Fennec. Google Chrome as a version 3.0.182.2 including Chromium as of 14 July 2009. Tizen Browser Seamonkey as a version 2.0 Conqueror 4.4.2 
Opera as a version 10.50. It was also supported in Opera 9.5 experimental video builds. Web uses WebKit GTK Plus as its rendering engine. As WebKit GTK Plus uses GStreamer to implement the HTML5 media player, and all the formats GStreamer supports including Thera are available in browser. Midori is another example of a browser that supports Thera by using WebKit GTK Plus. Browser plugins Anadex plugin via Ogplay Cortado, a Java-based applet Ethiora, a PHP wrapper for Cortado MV Embed HTML5 video tag wrapper for numerous plugin types VLC Media Player browser plugin for IE or Firefox Microsoft Edge, via the Web Media Extensions add-on Topic. Supporting media frameworks Direct show with use of OpenCodex GStreamer supported via Thera or FFmpeg module, supports GStreamer-based applications e.g. Totem and Songbird Phonon QuickTime including but not limited to Safari with use of XIPH QuickTime components Silverlight Highgate Media Suite is going to bring an open source Thera, Vorbis implementation in Silverlight. It will enable installation free support for HTML5 streaming video. <laughs> <laughs> Supporting applications FFmpeg own implementation. Helix Player Miro Media Player, formerly known as Democracy Player, M Player and Front Ends, Songbird, Totem, Movita and all G Streamer based players, VLC native support, XINE and all Libexine based players like Caffeine, Dragon Player and all Phonon based players. Topic: <coughs> Encoding. <coughs> 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 There are several third-party programs that support encoding through Libthiora. The Libthiora library contains the reference implementation of the Thera specification for encoding and decoding. Libthiora is still under development by the XIPH org foundation. The library is released under the terms of a BSD-style license. Also, several media frameworks have support for Thera. The open source FFD Show Audio Video Decoder is capable of encoding Thera videos using its Video for Windows (VFW) multi-codec interface within popular AVI editing programs. It supports both encoding and decoding Thera video streams and uses Thera's Alpha 4 libraries. However, many of the more refined features of Thera aren't available to the user in Fed Show's interface. The GStreamer framework has support for parsing raw Thera streams, encoding and decoding raw Thera streams to, from YUV video. Editing Streaming The following streaming media servers are capable of streaming Thera video. Topic Makers. Elfil is the main maker of cameras that record in Thera. Topic See also. Video editing software. Comparison of video codecs Comparison of video encoders <laughs> <laughs>